There are 8 billion devices in the world that have voice interfaces in smartphones, in your car, in home speakers, in appliances. The most common two problems that people speak about are giving machines vision and giving machines hearing. I realized that speech was special. Hi everybody, this is Raul Casas. I'm here in Montevideo, Uruguay, in the middle of traffic. From the west, but it's gonna go to the southwest in the next, I don't know, 12 hours or so. That will have some startup that is revolutionizing audio cleanup technology. This remarkable combination of signal processing and neural network processing strips away virtually all of the unpleasantness and the unintelligibility of that video or audio clip from noisy to clean. Babel Labs is touching on speech, on sound, music, how we listen, how we understand each other. The advent of deep learning is probably as significant as the advent of the microprocessor 30 or 40 years ago. From the beginning, we understood that we were building large, complex models, and so the ability to train on GPUs became essential to the existence and the concept of the company. We recognized that working with the Inception program would give us insights into what NVIDIA is capable of, insights into what this larger community of startups is doing, and direct support for not only some of the technical work, but this whole question of how do we start to raise our visibility in what is, in fact, a fairly noisy, crowded AI environment. We want to be able to speak clearly, we want to be able to say things in the way that we want to say them and use our voice. Luckily, uh, we are at a point in history where machines should make that process easier. I believe that what we're doing is important and that it will grow into something beautiful.